A former Eastern Michigan track star learns his sentence in a drunk driving crash that killed a mother of two. Prosecutors say Boaz Jaboye was drunk and driving on US 12 near Ecorse Road last April when he crossed into oncoming traffic and crashed into several cars. Kristen Knight died in that crash. Victor Williams joins us now. Victor, uh, an emotional day, no doubt, for the family. Yes, Devin, quite the emotional day. Lots of tears being shed right there in that courtroom. People versus Boaz Shaboyo. A moment that's been several months in the making, the sentencing for former EMU track star Boaz Shaboye for his alleged drunk driving role in the death of 38-year-old mother Kristen Knight. Multiple family members of the victim making statements on how their lives will never be the same. Today's our anniversary. It would be our third year together. It was hard for Christian's husband, Michael Knight, to hold back the tears as he held one of her only remaining possessions. She wore these hoodies. She went to Eastern Michigan, too. This is all I have of my wife. Left. You took her away. You took her away from their kids. Christian's mother, Janice, also had a few words about the void now created in her life. She will not be able to bring her children, my grandchildren, to see me ever again. Chaboye couldn't even hold back the tears himself as he begged for forgiveness. <laughs> I'm devastated by my actions that caused the loss of Christy Knight. <laughs> and, oh. But those cries fell on deaf ears. You won't be forgiven by me. So hopefully you can forgive yourself, but I won't do it. The prosecuting attorney tried her best to get the judge to give the maximum sentence. We are asking for 57 months um, to 15 years. But ultimately, the sentence given to the EMU Athletic Hall of Famer wasn't as harsh. Mr. Shaboy, as it is the sentence of court that you will serve 40 months to 15 years in the Michigan Department of Corrections. And just a really rough situation all around. Mr. Chaboye is going to be given a 103 day credit for time served. In the meantime, we're told that a civil lawsuit may be in the works from Christian's family against Mr. Chaboye himself. Victor Williams, Local 4. Yeah. Okay, Victor.